Okay, so let's create a shadow catcher in Eevee. And to make this work, you are going to need a light source. So I'm using a sun lamp here. And then I have this object that casts a shadow onto a plane. And this plane is going to function as a shadow catcher. In all actuality, this is just a material that is invisible, but with a visible shadow. So we're going to recreate this material and this is going to work perfectly as a shadow catcher. So to do this, we're just going to start off with a blank slate and jump into the shader editor. So let's just delete this principle BSDF and bring in a mix shader node. And then we're going to need a transparent node. And then we are going to need a diffuse node. And we're just going to go Shift D and duplicate this one here. And now we need to bridge this um, diffuse with this mix shader node here. So let's just go Shift A and search for our shader to RGB. And then just drop it down in the middle and connect it like that and take this diffuse and just bring it into the middle of this mix shader. Now this plane of ours is completely black so we need to go over to material properties here and under this window, the settings window, we need to change the blend mode from opaque to alpha blend. So now what we can do is um, select this uh, top diffuse node and go into the white and then just uh, bring down this uh, value like that. So now you can see that we have a white shadow and that is obviously not what we want. We want it to be black. So let's select the second one and then just drag down the value like that. And if you go back into the top one again, you now can determine the transparency of the shadow. So depending on your scene, you can just fine tune it like that. So this is the way you can create a really functional uh, shadow catcher in Eevee. And if you can like and subscribe, I would really appreciate that. Have a great day wherever you are and peace out.